In this video on Sons of the Forest, I'm going to be exploring the island just a little bit further and obtaining some cool weapons like the pistol and the modern axe, as well as some other pretty cool and useful items to use along the way. That being said, I just wanted to thank you guys for the support on the previous video. I really didn't expect it to go as far as it did. And lastly, if you do go on to enjoy this video and you want to see more of this type of stuff, please leave a like on it and subscribe. I hope you enjoy the video. Alright, so our first stop is going to be getting the modern axe so the modern axe is and the pistol are in those oh no 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 I, did, I didn't mean to scare you i don't really have time for this but uh she's close to the beach at least we know that so i don't want to get too close to her in fact i probably shouldn't move at all because apparently she um where'd she go calvin i told you to stay behind what are you doing here all right well you're here now so we might as well go we can we can catch up with virginia later we've got work to do anyway so I don't know if I was explaining this before. <laughs> the purple locations on the map, the purple dots, as you can see there, are the places where we can find modern axe and, and the pistol. So the pistol is in the water over there on that location. And I believe that the location that I'm heading to now is <laughs> the place for the modern axe and the flashlight. So I'm going to make my way there with Calvin. I don't actually want him to be with me because he can actually die, apparently. And I really don't want that. Calvin's, Calvin is so innocent he doesn't deserve to die all right but anyway let's keep moving on and i will see you guys when i'm there the hell is that noise or are they summoning a freaking demon here what oh uh, sorry sorry didn't mean to intrude you guys just uh go on about your business <laughs> i'm just gonna take your stuff all right see you guys later uh Carry on. Sorry to interrupt. I can stab him from afar like this. This is actually amazing. Ah, okay. <laughs> Not that it works very well. And... Oh. Alright. Absolutely. Ah! Alright, just, just give me my stuff back and I'll leave you alone, please. Oh, now there's another one here. Okay, we need to take some meds quickly. Ah! Oh, no. Oh, Okay, that actually really scared me. I'm just gonna have to book it. I'm just gonna have to run for my life right now. I'm surprised they don't even stop me trying to cut, uh, like, out of these ropes and just jump out. Just give me my bag. Just give me my bag. Please run. Okay. Uh, no, I learned my lesson from you. Like, you can do whatever you want, but I'm just gonna leave. Are you following? Oh, okay, he's following me. He's chasing me. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> no. Yes. Yes, just... Yeah. We can be friends. We don't have to- Ah! There's a grey one there. Here we are on the map. It's kind of close to the, the purple dot over there. We're gonna go check that out as well, because you can get a- f Oh my god, they followed me. You can get a flashlight, but here we go. Here's the modern axe. I, bro, I'm gonna mess you up. You see You see this? Look at this upgrade. I don't actually know where he is. Okay, there he is. I'm gonna mess you up. I got a nice upgrade now. Okay, I don't want to be here anymore. I just want to- Ah! Yes! God, the echo is crazy. What, where are you? Just, oh, you're so annoying and loud. Hey, no, 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 that's my spear. Come back here. Give back. Oh, I don't have any more arrows. This thing is an absolute game changer in the forest one. So, yep, it definitely is. He stole my spear. Where's he gone? Oh, here he is. Come here. Ow. Okay, God. How are you alive? Come here. He's running away with my spear. I guess he could keep it. Reminder of what happens when he messes with me. You can hear that beeping sound. So this is one of the places where the team team members have crashed. Oh my goodness, my ears with the beeping, dude. Okay, but we're close. Okay, put the GPS away. That's what's making that noise. So there's stuff here, and then I think, how do we... There we go. So there was a guy hanging on the rope there. I've dropped him down now, so we've got to get down there. Because he has a flashlight. We've got a flashlight now. Okay, wait, don't waste it, but put it away. No, I don't want to waste it. Oh my goodness, that beeping noise. That's the GPS. Okay, wait, I don't want to hold the flashlight. How do I just not do that? Okay, we got this, and we got a GPS locator, which we can use to put on Virginia, and then we have her tracking as well. So, next up on the list is probably going to be the gun. Should actually stop burning those guys, because you can get bones and from them, and then you can make bone armor. Ah! God, I hate that. I hate that. They're not even close to you and they do that. Oh. <laughs> Hi there. How you doing? We, uh, we good? We're not gonna fight? So I think these ones only attack you when they're in groups. 
Okay, so the reason I'm going in this direction is there's actually a cave here. So we're gonna make a pit stop on the way to getting the- I swear. They're probably not even that close to me. Anyways, uh, we're gonna make a pit stop on the way to getting the gun because here is actually two very other important things that we're gonna need to get, which is the mask and the flask. Now the flask is obviously, you know, self-explanatory. We can put water in it, which is really, really essential because we're not always gonna be- near a fresh water source. Okay, so there should be a little little opening here. All right, here. So this is a cave, but don't worry, there's no there's no bad dudes in it or anything like that. Okay, so let's let's try this flashlight out. Let's see how good it is. Oh, honestly, that is kind of helpful. Okay, so as you can see, we're in like this underground facility slash bunker over here. Now we want to come in here. The reason we got the printer isn't is this is a 3D printer here, so we can put. There's already some in the printer, but we're gonna put more. So there, a thousand milliliters, and then what we can do is here's the flask. So we're gonna make that, and then it's gonna 3D. Print that and then we'll just open these up as well and grab more printer resin. It's making it. How do I get rid of the flashlight? Like, how do I? There we go. You see, now we have a water flask and we don't have to just run to the water all the time. And then here's the other thing I'm gonna make which is the mask. So the mask, <clears throat> basically you can wear it and as long as you don't attack the cannibals, they're scared of the mask so they won't attack you. They'll just kind of look at you. <laughs> okay, so here's the mask. I didn't pull that out. Can you please stop? I don't want to waste the batteries. Okay, anyway, so here's the mask. All we have to do is just hold left click and yeah, th th this is... It obscures your vision, but it's not like you're supposed to wear it all the time. So, oh, does this replace my lighter? Because it's now, it's every time I press L, it picks up the flashlight. I don't want that. Okay, we're going to use the lighter just because the lighter is like an infinite source. All right, so we can come down here. We can get a watch. There's a couple valuables here. And then I'll show you this door, some money. Now this door, we need a key card to open the door. I don't have a key card and I have no idea where to get this key card. So, uh... Yeah, and then there's this over here. We get some wire. What is that noise? So yeah, that's pretty much it for this place. So uh, I'm going to head out. And if I encounter some cannibals, I will show you guys the mask in action. Hey, Calvin, buddy, you made it. And he's immediately shaking his head at me. What have I done wrong to you? Fine. <laughs> Walk away. I didn't need you anyways. Well, actually, I do. Please come with me. <laughs> All right, anyways, onwards to the boat. Okay, so here we are. So right out there, there's where we need to go. That's the boat or a little uh, raft, if you will, that we're going to go to. And that's where we're going to get the gun. So I'm going to just start swimming, but I have to be careful of sharks. Let's just take a peek underwater, see if there's any sharks. Oh, all right. We're here. Oh, hello. <laughs> He's just got some food, he had a gun, how did this guy die? He's got like food here, flares. Okay, I suppose there's not much left there, but still. Here we are, here's the gun. Amazing. We got ourselves a piss, ah! Oh, what was that? Is that the shark? My god, that scared me. Yep, it's the shark. Should I shoot it? Just once for the memes? I really can't move on here. All right, here it is. Yeah, get out of here. Leave. Awesome. I just wasted a whole nag if this was realistic. Honestly, I would say you had no excuse for drowning, because I mean... <clears throat> Damn, dude even had time for like good hygiene brushing his teeth out here. Right. So let's swim back to land, hopefully avoiding the shark. Oh, I dropped the flare. Ah! I'm sorry, I didn't mean to shoot you. Okay, I did, but like, oh, I just realized if he bites me again, I will die. Oh, no, 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 swim, please. Faster, just go. Ah, oh, what's that? Oh, okay, so it's seaweed. I'm an idiot. <laughs> okay, please. All right, just swim. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Is that Virginia? Over there on the beach? Or is that a cannibal? I can't see it now, but like, there was something there. Oh, these waves are heavy right now, but I think I'm out of shark territory, thankfully. Oh, Virginia is here. Wow, I just don't want to, like, scare her off or anything by moving too much. Okay, she's running. Should I follow her? I don't know what to do. I don't know if I should follow her or not. Okay, but I am hungry. It's been a long day, and, uh, honestly, it's it's almost nighttime, so I should get back before it gets nighttime. And she's just doing her own thing. I hope she's not, like, getting sus of me following her like that, because I'm really not. I'm just trying to get home. Wait, what's that? That's not Kelvin. Okay, this is a great chance to show off the mask. 
Let's let this guy see me first. Is this he gonna... Yeah, it is a cannibal. So I put the mask on, and then he's supposedly supposed to be scared of me. I can't move the map. Yeah, so he won't attack me. He just looks at me. Yeah, okay, so he runs away if you go, go towards him with the mask. Um... I think this is supposed to be a reference to the red man in the first game. I'm not entirely sure, but it's just what my brain is thinking. But yeah, they're scared of this, so it's really handy to keep around. Especially if you just don't have the health to fight. So I think we could also build here. I mean, if you look at this spot, there's an island in the middle and the cannibals can't swim. We'd only need to worry about winter. So it actually snows in this game and then this whole lake will freeze over, so that's fun. But I think that would be a good spot to build base because they can't actually, um, they can't actually get over. Problem is Calvin can't swim either. I think Calvin's actually hydrophobic. He doesn't even want to touch the water unless he's drinking it. Ah! God, come here. I've had enough of you. I've had enough. I'm done. You could just keep freaking terrorizing me. Man, this axe is amazing though. It kills them in like two swings and it chops down trees faster. So that's great. Okay, but Calvin is still all the way on the other side there. He didn't follow me much at all. But don't worry, he'll make his way uh, towards me. I don't know why he takes so long, but he does. All right, here we are. Home sweet home. Definitely got to finish this base build. Let's get the fire going. Stay warm. There we go. All right, do we have any food? I don't think so. All right, maybe next time we should go hunting. I guess we'll just go to sleep and hopefully get some food in the morning. Hopefully Calvin will be back in the morning. Wow, it's bright. I got so used to the night time there. Calvin is on his way still. Oh god. Alright. Oh that's a problem. That's a problem. Alright, just for the content, I'm gonna I'm gonna shoot these guys. Just pull out the gun. Yeah, what's up now? Huh? I got a gun. Oh, oh, scary. Scary. Yeah. Yeah, you wanna end up like your friend? Huh? Yeah, fight. Come on. Yeah. Oh, nice. Combat roll. Wasn't enough to save you, though. <laughs> Great. Alright. Uh, so let's take these bodies over to the campfire so that we can get some bone armor out of them. I'm pretty sure I shouldn't be wasting the ammo like that, but I'm doing it just for the content. <laughs> just to show off the gun. Okay. Fantastic. So we grab the bones. Oh, okay. Oh, we have max bones already. So in that case, let's make a bone holder. Bone storage. Keep it safe. So we'll just put it like over here. Not sure how much of this you can put in there. We'll make that. And then we can just weirdly store human bones. A very comforting thought, don't you think? <laughs> so we can use that later on for armor and stuff. Um, just to help defend us a little bit. As all the bones we just collected. All right. Great. So I'll chop down a couple trees just to show you how much faster the axe uh, actually cuts down trees in comparison to the old one. So I'll cut down one here and then I'll cut down another to show the other one. Alright, so this is the new axe. Much faster. I mean, look how quickly that is breaking. Okay, I just I have to actually have stamina though. Yeah. And, alright, honestly I'm not making it look very much faster. <laughs> It is definitely better though, and honestly we can use those logs for, uh, for our base. Alright, so let me take out the other one now and show you guys the... The other axe is a lot faster, even though I'm actually chopping properly now, so it looks faster on this one. But yeah, this one is this one is better, so I'm, I'm gonna use it. I mean, clearly, at least if not for the actual chopping down trees bit, at least it's faster when killing enemies. Man, I, I really miss the fact that there was a log sled in the old game, uh, or the first game. Like, I know you have Calvin, but he only takes one log at a time, so it can be a little bit annoying. But it's also cool because he chops down trees, so it's like a it's like a middle ground. It's good and it could be a little bit better. I mean, I don't see why you can't have log sleds in this game, but I guess it's just to make it a little bit more challenging. Alright, is that all the logs? Alright, so I guess I'll just uh, take these logs now and seeing as I've done this and just uh, start building up these walls. You guys can just see this. So this is the building system. It's very realistic. Like all of this, you actually have to like place pillars individually and stuff. Like there's a really cool mechanic um, and they definitely improved the building. Oh, you finally made it. How's your trip back? 
You took forever, Calvin. All right, let's just put the last of these logs in and then I'll call it for this episode. <laughs> okay, and that's the last log I have chopped up right now. So I think I'm gonna wrap this video up here. Um, we got quite a bit done in this episode. I mean, we got the ax, we have pistol now, which is awesome. I love the fact that there's guns in this game now. We got the water bottle, which is super cool and super essential. We'll have a drink here and then we have to refill it, but damn. I like that there's actually a animations as well for everything. Makes it just so much more realistic and fun. So there is also a shovel at some point which we could get that'll uh, unlock other hidden treasures. And you can also get, get attachments for the pistol. I have no idea how, but we'll figure that out. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy this, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe, you know, that whole YouTuber thing. <laughs> and I will see you guys in the next one.